San Diego County Mazda dealer now. Tonight, the Hard File catches up with Ty Andrews of Mod Squad fame. He played the tough police captain on one of the most successful shows of the late 60s. He recruited three young hippies to be cops, promising they wouldn't have to think on their friends. They all carried badges on Mod Squad, but Tide was the only one who looked like a cop. But last night's robbery makes six. His role as Captain Greer made him a father figure on screen and off. We thought we'd have a nice little family party. The kids that I would meet said, gee, we wish our dad was like you, you know, uh, and that kind of thing. And that's kind of touching. I said, well, it was, I was playing kind of myself anyway. You have 360 degree views. Tig now spends most of his time developing this breathtaking piece of property he owns just outside of L.A. Uh, this used to be the old stagecoach trail that went through here, uh, Malibu stage. It's become a family affair with his son John as architect. They'll eventually build seven luxury homes, each with a 10-acre lot. Ah, see, I remember this is from Mike Connors. Tig has also become known for his unusual artwork. It's made from, of all things, lint. We have six children, and my wife did about seven loads a day. And when the lint came out of the uh, dryer, I'd see some gorgeous colors. He decided long ago not to sell his work, so his own home has become crowded with art. I love to paint, and I don't care if anyone sees it. Tig and his wife raised their six kids, but they rarely got to watch their father on Mod Squad. He wanted them to have a normal upbringing, a normal life far from Hollywood. And all these years later, that's just what Tig has found for himself. It's a wild puppy. Tig's real name is Tiger, though he's now strong and muscular. He was sickly and weak when he was born, so his parents decided to name him after a powerful wild animal for good luck. Seems to have worked thus far. That's an update from the Hard Files. The nation's court system.